a world created by fat computer programmers comes a film so epic it increased ticket prices three whole dollars. Avatar. Meet Jake Sully, a Marine who is contacted by the government because his dead twin brother Tommy was part of a secret scientific program that engineered expensive synthetic avatar bodies capable of being driven by human drivers when wired into a computer, but only if the DNA genomes of the driver and the avatar body match, which Jake's does because he's a twin. So the government takes advantage of this fact by asking Jake to drive Tommy's avatar body to a rich deposit of space coal called Unobtainium, which is sitting under a tree called Home Tree, which is occupied by the native people called the Navi. It's kind of dumb. Meet Neytiri, but more importantly, meet her side bloobs. Together, they'll learn military bad, trees good. Travel to a futuristic world of spaceships, mech warriors, and uh, really crappy wheelchairs? Follow along with a team of scientists who blend in with the natives by wearing the Gap Khaki Collection. Discover the Navi, a strong and noble race of blue Indians fully in tune with nature, who are somehow helpless without the white man. It's actually kind of offensive when you think about it. This December, prepare for three hours of eyeball twitching. As you're force-fed the most obvious message ever. They're just goddamn trees. <laughs> it will leave you wondering did I see her nipple? Starring the recycled plots from Dances with Wolves, Pocahontas, Last of the Mohicans, An Inconvenient Truth, Native American History, and Fern Gully, Papyrus, um, I mean, Avatar. Ah, uh, we get it, we'll recycle. Please just make another Terminator already.